What's up, everybody? It's Auto Trainer, and today we're playing Red Dead Redemption 2. Now, let's go talk to Trelawney. Hey, what's up? I, um, I was, uh, leaving again? Yes, just leaving. I don't practically blame him. I'll see you soon. Perhaps. Uh, what do you mean? Well, if I was you, I'd disappear too. This is all pretty much over. But yeah. I'll be back. No, you won't. Let's not pretend no more. Yeah. I'll miss you, Arthur. You've been a fine friend to me. No, no let's not get over sentimental. Yeah. Oh, the place is quiet. Get out of here. Go with my blessings. Thank you, Arthur. Yeah. Just go, man. Found a friend looking for you. Mr. Morgan. Sir. Ah. How are you? A little better. I hope so. How can yeah. I help you? I'm sorry to impose on you again, but I believe I've made progress brokering peace. You have? I believe so. Colonel Favors has agreed to a meeting to discuss and maybe resolve his alleged grievances in mine. Now, he has lied to me more times than I care to remember, but maybe this time... He must want peace. Why oh, could he no. possibly want to humiliate us further? We got words for his kind, but they're colloquial. Uh, hmm. Perhaps I could make one last request. My sure. men are not allowed to carry arms. You want us to keep the peace? Yeah, it'll be a lot of dull talking and ceremony. But I feel with some non-tribe members hmm. present, their chances of lying or worse will be reduced. Ah. Will you, Arthur? It ain't my business, brother. No, I know. But it is mine. Do it for me. Charles, I got I've saved your life. You have. Do it for me. Sure. Come on. Yeah, I mean... You owe this man. You should have him do your negotiations. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> well, I guess Josiah's finally gone. It's probably for the best, I mean... Charles. Thank you for doing this, both of you. You have already done so much. Ain't a problem. Just hope nobody recognizes me. I've had a few yeah. run-ins with the army recently. Yeah. I wish we could have done more to control the situation. That shouldn't have gotten involved. Now Eagle flies us under arrest. It certainly won't yeah. help our case today. I will find a way to help him. I promise you. I just hope Colonel Favors can be reasoned with. I am well, not we'll have to wait and see. Very much, but when our people are sick... I'm sorry, just... In the off chance that Colonel Favors... Don't want to be friendly, we're gonna just have this as a... As a little backup, yeah? Here we go. Looking hungry. And we find our medicine and supplies are being... Deliberately withheld. How can we not view that as something personal? I don't know. Our sacred sites? How can I, I don't know. The evil flies and the others that they shouldn't fight back? Maybe that's part of the reason they're doing these things. Because they want you to fight. To be able to say, look, you see how these savages behave? Perhaps. Thank you for helping Captain Monroe to retrieve those vaccines, Arthur. Of course. We have the meeting and as one person who knows the true situation at least, I still have hope that we can come to an agreement. Here's to hoping, I guess. Here's to hoping. I'm really rooting for you, Reigns. I really am. Charles knows that better than anybody. But I guess Josiah is gone, Mr. Trelawney. I mean... I frankly don't blame him. I 
mean, now that I think of it, I might have saved Strauss by getting him out of there. And now I saved Jos Josiah. Hey, what's up, man? What's good? What's happening? I'm about to, uh... Traffic in the uh, Palau Vichy Opti. What? No. Oh, I thought we were leaving. Just in case the meeting goes sideways. Yes, Reigns, I'm le I'm dying over here. Whoa. There we go. Yeah, boy. Lord knows you need it. Oh, I can't put my face mask on. Ah, oh, it doesn't really matter. I don't think. Colonel Favors, Captain Munro, we come in peace. Hello again. Who are these two? Yeah. They're uh, friends of my people. Hmm. Interesting looking fellows. <laughs> they won't cause any trouble. Well, I should hope not. Yeah. Listen, Mr. Uh, Chief. Yes, uh, Mr. I can't say that silly name. In English, they call me Rain's Fall. Yes, yes, I'm, uh, I'm sure they do. Listen, we're all Americans here. No, okay. Want an outcome. But quite frankly, quite frankly, I, I'm confused. Your men are little more than criminals, in my opinion. Yeah. Keep breaking peace treaties we've made, causing disturbances in everybody's lives. Captain Monroe. But I pride myself on being a gentleman. Really, I do. But there are limits. So, let me be very... Are you okay, man? Somebody. Jackson, take him away. Where was I? You're a gentleman with limits? <laughs> I'm coughing, man. Facetious, sir. Come this way, buddy. I said, are you being facetious, Captain Monroe? No, sir, I am not. Chief Reigns. Okay, thank you. <gasps> Chief Reigns. It's quite a cough. Sure. Wait here. I'll fetch you some water. Uh, I'll be fine. Ah, uh, thanks, Wait. man. No, no. You know he's going to have Monroe court martial Or attempt to. He's going to make a disgrace of him. Monroe? Seems huh. likable well enough for a West Pointer. Why? You know what Favors is like. Because he thinks it's right. Because he thinks Monroe is a patsy. Or a spy. He's convinced he has something to do with those vaccines getting stolen. Huh. He thinks Monroe is going to force him into making a concession with the Indians. So he removes Monroe. Who removes how? Favors wants him tried for treason. And hang. Is that what he favors? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because he doesn't want to back down. His whole professional life. You know what they say about him. Hightail Favors. The man who missed a battle. Poor Monroe. Kind of liked him. Oh, snap. Not Monroe. Not Monroe. Just gonna chill here now. Just wait for my... Uh, Feeling better? Yeah. Come on. Yeah. As I cough the some more. The currently occupy belong to the United States government. Why is this so confusing, sir? Why? Good day, Colonel Favors. 
Well, that was remarkably unproductive. <gasps> I'm afraid the federal government was quite clear, Colonel, that it wanted peace, and peace for all, and that the treaty had not been broken by anybody. Oh, is oh. that so, sir? And did it want impudence, sir, from a junior oh. officer in public? Was that its plan, too, sir? You insult me. You insult the regiment. Arrest this man. Arrest me? Rose uh, insubordination. What? Disobeying an order. Treason. Are you mad? You had those vaccines stolen. You disrupted a negotiation. Let oh. him go. This is all getting out of hand. Hi, right, Captain Monroe. Let's get out of here. Hi, if I were you, I'd keep my yeah. mouth shut, amigo. Yeah. Yeah. I don't want to kill this man. That's right. Get away with this. Hey. Okay. Yeah, don't make me do this. Uh, Oreo. Oh. Uh, uh. Yeah, you ain't killing shit. Ah, uh, rain's fall. Wait up. Yeah, don't you dare threaten me. Don't you ever threaten the auto trainer like that. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Sorry for being quiet, I'm just really trying to listen. Oh. Boom. Boom. Boom, oh my gosh. This is so violent. Out the damn way, you big horn sheep. Oh, Oreo. Go with him, Oreo. Oh, I hope you're alright, Oreo. Please be alright. I don't know. Can you shoot? I can't do it. I'm trying to kill you. Ah, ah. Swore an oath. You swore an oath. Oh my god. Forget the oath. Scatter gun time. Ah. Ooh, headshot. Look at that headshot. Of course he did. Oh, oh, dynamite time. Oh, oh. oh, sorry, horsies. That was so bad of me. I know it is. This is not working out to what I, the way I wanted it to work out. Okay. Mm. I, I I don't know how people like why they tell you. Come on. Come on, Can you shoot? All right. Come on, come on, come on. Ah. Yeah. 
There we go. Oh, headshot. Headshot. Welcome to my normal life, I guess. <laughs> Oh, did you actually... Uh, did you actually think that? Oh, right in your hip, boy. Charles, I'll pull out the scatter gun. I see them. Ah, uh, no, Oreo. Get up, Oreo. Horse or that horse? What do we do now? I don't know. Get out of here. Fast. Take you to the station. Okay. I can't believe that just happened. Believe it. I've been an army man my whole life. Not anymore. Them they was gonna have you hang for treason. You can't die for those fools. Nah, what man. About the chief? We'll do what we can. I guess I won't be submitting my report. I wouldn't think so. That's probably the least of your worries right now. Definitely be the least of my worries. Doing some bloody report. While we're riding, I'm drinking. Ah, oh my god. I just thought we were doing a mission with Mr. Trelawney, but I guess not. Oh, there's a train for you right there. You might want to lose those, uh, <laughs> army stuff there, mate. <coughs> My gosh, Arthur, you is, you are not Get sounding here, good. Kevin Monroe. I fear it may be Mr. Monroe from now on. I'm sorry about your career. Yeah. Yeah, come on, Will Wheaton. You know you Here's want some it. Money. You take it and get out of here. Start Actually, I fuck Will Wheaton. I hear Tahiti's nice. Thank you. <laughs> Just hop on a train of sand and they jump on a boat. But avoid Guam. Where? Forget about it. <laughs> yeah, make sure you dip them. Dip the dip the dip the <laughs> yeah, you know it, Charles. I'll be there. <clears throat> Are you okay? Yeah. Never better. What are you doing here? Well, yeah. I'm on my way down to Mexico. They're finally sending me on a mission. Uh. Brother Dorkins is very jealous. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <coughs> What's wrong? I'm, uh, I'm dying. I'm dying, sister. Okay. Yeah, I got TB. Tuberculosis. I so, got Lucas. it. Beating a man to death <clears throat> for a few bucks. <sighs> I've lived a bad life, sister. We've all lived bad lives, Mr. Morgan. I guess in a sense. Sin. But I know you. You don't know me. Forgive me. 
but that's the problem. You don't know you. What do you mean? I don't know, but whenever we happen to meet, you're always helping people and smiling. <laughs> I had a son. He passed away. I had a girl who loved me. I threw that away. My mama died when I was a kid. And my daddy... Well, I watched him die. That weren't soon enough. My husband died a long time ago. Life is full of pain. But there is also love and beauty. That's so true. We always what miss that. What am I gonna do now? Be grateful that for the first time, you see your life clearly. Sure. Perhaps you could help somebody. Helping makes you really happy. <sighs> this is true. But I still don't believe in nothing. <laughs> Often neither do I. Huh? But then I meet someone like you, and everything makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> You're too smart for me, sister. <sighs> I guess I. I'm afraid. Oh no. There is nothing to be afraid of, Mr. Morgan. Take a gamble that love exists and do a loving act. All aboard. All right. I shall try. I know you will. Here you go. Uh, safe travels. Goodbye. Goodbye, Mr. Morgan. Goodbye! Sister. Farewell. Thank you for all your help. <sighs> well... Oreo? I think you know just as well as I do what happens when my time comes. You just run. You be free. Maybe if you go be with Rainfall's people, I'm sure they'll treat you good. If you can get to them, or just spend your life being free. Because I can't see you with nobody else. Alright? I, I love you, Oreo. I love you. You're my best friend in the whole damn world. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's let's go see what we must do. Well, there's Charles. Or do I want to go talk to Sadie? What's Sadie got to do? Seems like everybody needs to speak with me. I don't know why. Hmm. But anyways. We can at least go help Charles out. Alright, well, we'll see you guys in the next video.